I want to thank you for listening to the people. Several speakers took the floor at this week's Greensboro City Council meeting to say thank you. I'd like to start off by thanking the City Council for the uh, steps in the right direction you all made last week. Community members and activists praised the City Council for releasing body camera video last week, showing former Greensboro police officer Travis Cole using what many call excessive force on Dewan Yersay. We want people to be treated equally in every aspect of city activity. The video shows the former officer punching your say in the face and pinning him to the ground. Some said making the video public is a huge step towards regaining the public's trust. Look at the footage and if you tell me what you saw is the way you would police Greensboro, I will stand and say you don't, you don't deserve a badge. Many others, dressed all in blue, showed support for the former officer. I personally support Officer Travis Cole and Officer Charlotte Jackson for their actions on June the 17th, 2016. Ryan Walton of the Greensboro Police Officers Association says the video doesn't tell the whole story. Just watching the camera footage alone isn't enough. You need to have the context and the legal basis of what's going on prior to watching that camera footage. Walton also says the June incident was already being investigated by the police department and says there was no cover up. This was not something that was swept under the carpet. In Greensboro, Kim Wynn, Fox 8 News.